Okay, so hello everyone, it's me, Best Dean. So today I'm going to teach you how to um, so how to add that uh, coupon code registration pin to the earning website. So we start now. So let's continue from where we start. So we are going to first upload false registration that is the name of the plugins so when you upload it you have to set it after we set it then we have to add the form for registration and for logins so uh, okay so here we are we we'll start now we are going to be adding dashboard Okay, so go to plugins, plugins, add new, go to upload, upload, upload plugins, uh, have to put it in a desktop mode so that you can see the button of install, the button to install it. Okay. So let's So we have to install the plugins. Okay. So you click install. So after installing it, you activate it. You have to look for it and activate it. Okay, so after installing the app, the the plugins, you have to go to install. Install plugins, install plugins, then you scroll down to that is after the it has successfully installed. You see something like buy register that is the name that is going to show. Okay, so you now click activate. You click activate. So wait for it to load. Okay. So, so we go to after installing after activating that that file register, register. Now, when you go to menu, you will see file register here. So click on it. You go to setting. Put the invitation code first.
okay you will land here so you click you see invitation code enable invitation code so mark it so if you want to add a collect is the place you add uh, your coupon code is this place you add the coupon code here there are many times you want them to use it here then the expiry date if you don't want to uh, go to expiry date you can leave it then you press add code but we are not we are not going to do that now let's go to the form the registration form now i've activate here uh, enable invitation code okay so i go to buy registration register sorry that go to manage form okay now if you come to this place you will see a registration form now we are going to edit this form and add where we, so a uh, user can can input the registration pin so um let turn it to desktop mode so that you can see it well okay so this this is the position form I have the username, we have the email, we have the, we have the password. So we are going to add, um, we are going to add this, um, how do you call it? Click here, sorry, not here. Okay, now let's zoom it click here advanced view you will see invitation code look at it here invitation code so you have to click it okay close it back if you have clicked it close it back so you will find it here invitation code you can move it up Okay, let's edit this first before we move it. So, uh, invitation code, you have to edit it. You see, I see the place I click. I click that little uh, pen. So, I have to edit it. The name, I have to write um, coupon code, coupon, or you can write anything, or the registration pin. Anything. Registration. Registration. Break pin. Or coupon code. Anyone. You know, my display is required. So that it will require. If you want to log in, if you want to register, you must input it before you register. If you want it to show in user profile, you put it here. So that is it. Um, let's try something here. Validation message you have you have to input red pin or red pin is invalid. It here, it will continue. You can write anything there that has the validation message. Okay, so we have set it. You can see red pin. So we have set it. I, you can drag it. Sometimes won't move it. I don't know what is wrong now that it won't. You don't want to move. So we now click save setting. Now, we so I want to register. The person will find a red pin in the registration form. Okay, now we have set the registration form. Now, how to add the pin? Go to go to invitation code. Okay. Invitation code. You can see inside the invitation code. 
Now if you want to add code now, you can write something like any code, any code you like to, to the four. I'm writing the code now. Anything at all that can be your code. I'm writing code. Okay. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have six code now. Now the uses you have to put only one, only one time, one time, not more than one time. Or you can add any if you want people to use it five times or only one time. After after they will use it once. That's why so now add code. I have to click add code. So so we have done with this this so let's go to the registration page and see how it works. So okay now let's register now and see how it will work. Okay, registration. You can add the page registry. Yeah, registration, okay. Let's go to registration. Okay, now here we are. You can see how it is now. Registration form. Just in the form below. You can see it. Now you an email, password, confirm password, ping. Okay, let me try something. Let's see if I enter wrong pin now. I click submit. Let's see what it will give us because I enter wrong pin. Let's see what red pin is invalid by one form. Okay, you can see the way it work. So is it so thank you it's me best thing um our next lesson is how to add like you have to add a picture here as in the logo then when you check the front page that is the front page means the first page that will, will come to when you, you can see we need a picture here so how to do it that's right so but before we continue you have to learn 
solo learn you go to solo learn you learn uh, basically html okay so that is it for today thanks